Mama June. Family crisis Ella Grace feels unhappy. Why? Fans think Anna Cardwell's ex, Michael, could win custody battle. Hello everyone. My name is Tara G. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And give this video a like up this week. WeTV dropped a teaser for Friday's episode of Mama June, Family Crisis, and in it, fans saw that Lauren Pumpkin Efford's daughter, Ella Grace, was very unhappy. Usually, she's a precocious child and full of smiles. So what made her feel so sad? Read on to find out. When fans see Pumpkin's daughter six, they often see her testing the boundaries with her mom. Or, they see her zooming around on her bike. On other occasions, she's with her little brothers, playing at being a nurturing mom. In 2020, Alana Thompson entered her in a pageant, despite Josh and Pumpkin hating the idea, and the little kid loved it. So, it's seldom that we TV fans see the cute kid looking unhappy. Ella Grace did sound sad and wistful in Mama June. Family crisis when June Shannon ran off with Gino Doak. While Dodo tried to find her sister and bring her home, Young Tinks missed her grandmother a lot. Later, fans slammed June for claiming that she loved her Tink. Now, it's time for June's grandchild to feel unhappy again. Mama June, family crisis teaser shows unhappy Tinks. Justin Stroud shared a teaser by WeTV for the upcoming episode, and on Instagram, he said in the caption, In the real, Ella Grace lay cuddled up to Alana Thompson, and she seemed very unhappy. Crying, she told Alana, who wiped away her tears, I want to go with you. Sadly, she had to tell her niece that she can't go with her. Other scenes revealed Alana claiming she'd see her mom in jail if necessary, probably over the missing money. Meanwhile, Pumpkin talked about not letting June Shannon get away with it. Anna Chickadee Cardwell said her goodbyes to Alana, who was on her way to college. And Ella's grandmother planned her birthday week. In the comments, a Mama June, Family Crisis fan talked about Ella Grace and how she probably didn't initially understand the idea of Alana Thompson going to college. One of them said, Didn't Ella say earlier in a few episodes back that she wanted Alana to go to college already so she can have the other bed? Lol, I love Ella, she reminds me so much of Alana when she was that age. What are your thoughts about Ella Grace being so unhappy because Alana Thompson was going to college? Do you think that it might be because she lost other people in her life, like Gino Doak, and even June Shannon for a while? Additionally, she loved playing at pageantry with her aunt. Shout out in the comments below, and come back here for all your Mama June, family crisis news. Mama June Shannon may just have something to worry about as Anna's ex, Michael, possibly has a solid argument to win custody of Caitlyn. Could Michael legally take Caitlyn from Mama June? Keep reading for the details. When Anna Chickadee Cardwell passed away, fans of her reality TV family only had one big question. Who gets custody of her daughters? Presently, her eight-year-old daughter Kylie is in the custody of her biological father, Michael. Anna's 11-year-old daughter, on the other hand, is in the custody of Mama June Shannon. As TV shows Ace has reported, fans of this reality TV family have had all sorts of issues with the custody arrangements. For starters, fans thought the girls being split up after their mother died wasn't good for their mental health. Likewise, fans question if Mama June is even fit to take care of children, as she couldn't even properly take care of her children. Sadly, it isn't really clear who the biological father of Anna's oldest daughter is. As TV shows Ace reported, Mama June recently revealed on a shocking TikTok video that her daughter was never able to figure out who Caitlin's father was. Mama June Shannon, however, argues that Anna Cardwell's ex, Michael, doesn't have any legal rights to Caitlin because he isn't her biological father. In chatter on Reddit, however, fans beg to differ. Fans argue that keeping the girls together as they mourn the death of their mother is absolutely what's best for them. Likewise, 
fans point out that Michael has always been in the girls' lives. Furthermore, he is stable and can give the girls what Mama June and her husband can't. One fan penned in a thread on Reddit discussing whether Michael had a fair shot at getting Anna Cardwell's other daughter. One fan noted they would be willing to donate money to help Michael fight Mama June in court. Others questioned if what Caitlin wanted would be taken into consideration. Several fans chimed in to clarify that typically a child has to be 13 before their opinions are considered in court. Unfortunately, that would make Caitlin a few years too young for her opinion to hold any water. What do you think is best for Anna Cardwell's children amid her passing? Should Michael be fighting to keep them together? Or is he making this situation more difficult? Let us know in the comments. And keep coming back for more updates on this messy situation. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and stay with us.